This is Graham Armfield from Coolfields Consulting. In this video we're going to look at how you can emulate mouse movement in Dragon Naturally Speaking. Previously we saw that it was not possible to use the click command to access the option links in the top right hand corner of this Google page. The reason for this was that the image that forms the link does not have any alternate text attached to it. So in situations like this the Dragon Naturally Speaking user is forced to use other means to access the link and that is where the various mouse commands that Dragon features come into their own. There are two ways of using the mouse pointer with Dragon. The mouse grid function where you can zoom into a particular area and then issue a command or moving the mouse directly using speech commands. So firstly mouse grid. After you have voiced the mouse grid command a grid appears overlaying the screen the screen is divided into nine areas and you voice the number that contains the location where you want the mouse pointer to be. Each time you do this a smaller grid appears and you voice further numbers until you have sufficient precision to put the mouse pointer exactly where it's required. After that you can issue a command, the most common being click. Let me show you how to access the options on this page. Wake up. Mouse grid. Three. Five. 7, 1, click, go to sleep. So while it's not as easy as voicing the name of the link to click, it's still possible to place the pointer quickly with practice. The second method involves moving the mouse across the page to the correct place and then issuing a command. Firstly, let's move the pointer back towards the middle of the screen and get rid of that drop down. OK. Wake up. Move mouse up. Move mouse up faster. Stop. Move mouse right. Move mouse right very fast. Stop. Move mouse right. Stop. Mouse click. Go to sleep. Dragon users won't be happy if websites force them to do a lot of this. Mm -hmm.